guys, welcome back to my channel. I am the Electrify Latina and today we're going to be doing one of my favorite videos, which is an unboxing video. This is the Acomile Cola Bear 750 watt mid drive motor. This is my very first time testing out a mid drive. Super excited. Before we dive in, let's roll the intro. All right, guys, so this is how it came to, comes exactly right out of the box. Thank goodness the box is in pretty good shape. It only had, you'll see, you'll see some pictures up on the screen. Just one big hole. It didn't do any damage to the bike, so woo. Um, so this is one of the e-bikes that I do sell on my online store at TerraProCycle.com. And like I've said in other videos before, I bought this with my very own money. And this is so I can make sure that it's a comfortable, safe, reliable, and that it does what the manufacturer said it's said it does as far as performance. So let's start cutting, guys. Like as you can see, there's a bunch of foam um, and little uh, cords that we need to cut through uh, in order to to get this up. I mean, I, I won't bore you in this section, but I just wanted to let you know what what you guys need to do. Oh. Uh, as you can see it comes like very well protected and the bike came like away from the box meaning it was wider so it wasn't brushing against like things that could get damaged from from shipping so all right and usually like bikes come with their own tools um, that you're going to need to put them together, but if not, I have a whole toolkit here, and this is basically, basically a combination of all the e-bikes and e-scooters that I have gotten. All right. So, yeah, you know, I would say this is the part that takes the longest. Because uh, usually once you have all this foam removed and stuff, it, like, it goes by really fast. There we go. Things are starting to come together. This is one of the fenders. It's a plastic fender. I'm glad so, because like metal fenders can rattle sometimes. And this is an electric mountain bike, so oh, I want to keep it as light as possible. I mean, it's already a heavy bike, so plastic fenders. We're going to put them over here. And then this is the handlebars here. Gosh, this is so exciting. I just, I love unboxing new products. It's like, you can see them on pictures, but once you have the real deal, it's a completely different story. All right. So, so far guys, I have not seen any damage from shipping, which is always a huge relief. Uh, more zip ties here. All right, and here's your, wow, this is a long handlebar. Way longer than like all my other e-bikes. Mineral oil, meaning it's a hydraulic brakes. Uh, let's see. Then we have our forks. Forks are nicely wrapped too. It's like kind of balancing it here so it stays up. And then the zip ties are really tightly packed. All right. Oh. There we go. Ah! Forks are revealed. This is a mountain bike, so forks are important. You want them to aid you with the uh, terrain you will be traversing. The off-roading terrain. There's Suntour forks. I think that's a pretty decent brand. I, I honestly, I don't know a lot about suspension forks. And this is your front light. Also very nicely wrapped here and protected. You know, like this is like when you, when you get a new e-bike from, from a company, 
the way they wrap things like starts talking to me about how the company is right like how professional they are how much they care about getting their products in the best shape for their customers let's go now you have your seats here so this is a pretty narrow seat definitely more meant for the mountain bike riding that you'll be doing it's more narrow uh, and i see so that the tires here so this is the first time i'm going to be riding on this type of tire so all my e-bikes so far are most of them are 20 by fours so these are 27.5 in diameter by three actually no skinnier than three they're 2.3 inch tires so super excited about that i love just trying new things um yeah i would say i have a re really nice variety of e-bikes now folding bikes scrambler style e-bikes now a mountain mountain bike e-mountain bike um this one has a buffet motor which I'm very excited about. That's a, a really nice motor, very reliable and powerful. And like I said, this is my first time trying a mid-drive e-bike. And from what I've heard, some people just really rave about, about mid-drive motors, about how they're better for off-roading. They're gonna work better when you're pedaling. Woo! We don't want the bike to fall. So I got one of the tires loose here. There we go. So this is gonna be your front tire, obviously. Comes very well protected. I'm just gonna leave it over here. And I see the tread is really nice for, uh, for off-roading. Now the frame, um, the frame comes really nicely packed. And guys, from what I can see, the welding it's just like wow it's a beautiful beautiful paint and the welds are super smooth it's it's really nice all right here comes the 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 main body of the bike wow it's beautiful and i love when the bag uh, when the batteries are concealed in the frame just for looks i think it just looks so much much cleaner and I feel like the, the battery is like protected in here too. Especially if you're gonna be riding in like rough, <coughs> rough terrains. So we just have this like back part here to reveal. And more, more foam, more foam. Now the kickstand. There we go. Oh. Okay, seems a pretty substantial kickstand. That's good. And then you have a uh, rear suspension. So it's like pretty affordable spring suspension here. Um, I'll probably be doing a bunch of upgrades coming up. So you guys know I love doing that. Um, and this is my very first mountain bike. So all of my e-bikes, they have like specific or different purposes. Pedals. Probably came in a different box. And so far, guys, I don't see a uh, box of tools here. Well, no, who knows? So this is probably one where we have our charger, pedals, and maybe some tools. We'll discover that. And we just have this part to get released back here. And voila. All right, guys, so when I come back, the bike is going to be all put together. See you in a second. And we're back. So this is the bike fully assembled. It took about 45 minutes and it's going to be depending on your ex experience level for sure. Um, so far, I love the bike. I think it's gorgeous. The color doesn't do it justice on pictures. This is a very different red. And it is just so smooth, the, the wells, the only parts where I can see the, the wells are down here. The paint is just gorgeous. Um, it feels like a really solid bike. And I do see a lot of Shimano parts, which is, you know, name brand components. A few ones that are a, a no name brands. Like for example, I do want to change the stem 
um, it's just like a little like skinny for, for my taste. So that's going to be happening soon. And then, um, so the parts that needed to be installed, so that the, was the front tire. And I love that it comes with a quick release down here. Um, and for me, it's just for transportation. It'll be a lot easier to put in my car. I don't have an e-bike rack yet. So that's how I'll be transporting it for now. And then, um, uh, yeah, I've noticed the handlebars are like the, the longest ones that I have seen. And um, and obviously, I think this is just meant for like the good maneuverability for uh, a mountain bike. And then oh, the fenders, you have to install two. They're plastic fenders. It, it's pretty easy. I think they look pretty cool. It gives it an aggressive, it uh, uh, looks aggressive. And then you do get that keys for, uh, it's a locked battery, which is nice for like security if you ever need it to leave it outside somewhere. Um, so yeah, guys, so this was the, uh, the unboxing part. I can't wait to take it out on this first ride. Oh, and the battery kept, came charged at like a 60%, which is nice when manufacturers do that. So you can take it out on a ride right away. And the display is a color display. So that was a nice surprise too um all right guys well thank you so much for joining the electrify latina there's a lot more videos that are going to be coming you know like things got hectic with the holidays as you guys would understand but we're back we're going to be doing a lot of content like there's like new e-bikes new scooters um this one is from my online store so you can check it out it's at terraprocycle.com it's a mid-drive bike it is just gorgeous all right guys i hope you have a wonderful day Thanks for, for checking me out again, and you know what? Happy riding! If you do want to pick up this electric vehicle, I've got the link in the description below. Also, make sure to check out my website at terraprocycle.com. There you can find all of my products sorted by category, including this one, of course. Hit the like button before you go, and please subscribe for the latest in electric bikes, scooter, moped, and hybrid reviews. I do love hearing from you, and I reply to every single comment. Lastly, please join my community of electric vehicle fans on my Facebook page and Instagram, which you can find below in the description. Thanks for watching, and happy riding!